Christ, I hope you are all doing well today. Today I want to talk about whether or not Christians should watch horror movies. If you are a non-believer, the things I'm about to say may not make sense to you. You are welcome to stay and to watch for whatever the reason may be. The answer to if Christians should watch horror movies is uh, no. There are many reasons that go into this. This short video will help sort it out if you're having difficulties understanding why. Horror movies. Scenes with jump scares filled with disturbing actions and creatures. They usually involve killing, ghosts, which in reality are demons, bloody murder, and at times sexual scenes. Do you, as Christians, think we should feed ourselves with these things? Whether they are gruesome or somewhat, they are all defiling for us as Christians. But how are horror movies bad for us? To name a few reasons, ultimately they glorify Satan, it grieves the Holy Spirit, and it brings darkness to our body. And when we watch those things, we start to drink the cup of demons as well. If we're all gonna be honest, horror movies promote the very things that the devil associates with, and in a way glorifies Satan. Things like death, demons, sexual immortality, and darkness. We Christians don't and should never have pleasure in these things. We need to keep ourselves pure in front of the Lord. Matthew 5 8 says, Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. Yet when we watch these things, we start to support it, and we know God will never be okay with that. Christians that especially have the Holy Spirit should never ever watch horror movies. Do horror movies contain love, patience, peace, kindness, gentleness, self-control? Do they contain the fruits of the spirit at all? No, they don't. Horror movies have the demonic fruits of the flesh. Galatians 5, 19, 21. Fornication, uncleanliness, witchcraft, hatred, and more. These things won't inherit the kingdom of God. When we allow ourselves to watch horror, we grieve the spirit deeply in the result of our choice. Scripture says to not do this, Ephesians 4, 30, 31. Jesus said, Matthew 6, 22 through 23, that the eye is the lamp of the body. Therefore, if we look especially willfully at killing and demonic images, we bring darkness to our bodies, and that will affect the way we think and do things which is anything but godly. This is not good at all either. We are called to be the light of the world, not encouragers of darkness. So let us watch things that edifies and brings the light of God into our bodies. Also that you don't have to hide underneath your blankets in order to sleep. Lastly, but most importantly, we start to drink the cup of demons. When I say we drink the cup, that means we are partaking in an activity. In 1 Corinthians 10, 21 says, Ye cannot drink the cup of the Lord and the cup of devils. Ye cannot be partakers of the Lord's table and of the table of devils. We as Christians are partakers of holy things, seeking God and doing His will. We drink the cup of the Lord, which involves peace in Him and love and boldness. But when we watch horror movies, we eventually partake with the world and its traits. We might partake with fear and thoughts of hatred and murder we get from the movies. God forbid that we do the things which we watch on horror films. We cannot be doing this. This leads to being a lukewarm, which God hates. Revelations 3:15 through 16 He'd rather you be hot or cold. Let us not partake in supporting and watching those kinds of movies because God is always watching us. 
let us watch and guard our hearts from darkness. Also, look at Matthew 6, 24. If you have been watching horror films and you're a Christian, it might be hard to break the habit of watching those things. Let us pray for you that you might overcome the things that grab hold of you. Really seek God in this situation. God is faithful and will cleanse you from all unrighteousness. 1 John 1, 9. Thanks for watching. I hope this makes you really think about horror movies and if you should watch them.